Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is a very special day because it's been a year since I'm on YouTube. So it's my one year anniversary. Now officially tomorrow is the day that I'm on YouTube for one whole year, but we're going to celebrate it today. And I'm also going to share some of my YouTube analytics on my Instagram page. So if you are interested, I don't know if it's posted on there yet, but it will come soon. So I am going to share that with you on Instagram. So I'm just going to tell you a little bit of my YouTube journey and how I got here. And after that, I am going to make a YouTube vision board together with you. So if you're not really interested in my story about how I got here, you can skip to here. But if you are interested, here is my story. Now, the real reason that I started my YouTube channel is because I really liked to film and edit videos. And my last two vacations, I didn't take any pictures, but I filmed and at the end I could put everything together and I got a little movie about my vacation and I really loved that. And I was always sad when I was done because I wanted to edit more and see more of my vacation videos. So I thought to myself, why not start a YouTube channel? Now, I didn't really know where to start, so I made a mind map uh, with a couple of topics that I really liked, and I have it here with me. So this was the mind map I made a year, no, more than a year ago. And these are all of the things that I really like to do. So I'm a dancer, and I work out, and I thought I could maybe do a day in the life. And also I'm a graphic designer and I could show you some DIYs and Disney stuff, how I designed that on the computer. And I'm also a real foodie, so I could share healthy recipes, Disney food, what I eat in a day or in a week. And also here is the DIY section and I could DIY Disney or go thrift shopping. Now I circled pink and blue what came up the most and that was DIY and Disney. And in the end, these were the three topics that you can find on my channel. Now, I wanted to try this for at least a year to see if I liked it. And if I liked it, I would continue. And if not, I would stop. But the good news is that I really like this. So I am going to continue with my YouTube channel. So when I started my YouTube channel, I had zero subscribers. And now, one year later, I have 142 subscribers and i am so happy with every single one of you and i really want to thank you for watching my videos liking my videos uh, commenting on them and subscribing to my channel because without you it wouldn't be as much fun as it is so that was a little story on how my youtube adventure started and how it's going till now and as i said i'm just going to continue because i like it way too much and today I am going to make a YouTube vision board together with you. So I got a very big canvas that I will try to show you. This is my very big canvas for my very big dreams. <laughs> it's way too big. You can just barely see my table under here. So that is how big this canvas is and first thing i'm going to do is paint it and i am going to paint it in this nude color and then i'm going to do the borders with the black paint color and i have a lot of different things here that i can use some skewers and some how do you call this wood slices and i have some stirs and i have some sheets with graphic designs on there with florals and i really like this then some glitter alphabet letters some fake leaves and things to write on so and when i am done with my vision board of course i'm going to share everything that's on there with you
painting the canvas and the inspiration for these borders are from XO McKenna and I will link her down below and I really like how this looks. It's still a little bit wet but when it dries completely I will decorate this with all of this stuff.
so as you can see this is my finished youtube vision board and i will take you to the first part so i got a quote that says life begins at the end of your comfort zone and then i found this make it happen and i thought it was perfect so i really had to get out of my comfort zone to start with youtube and i have to do it again and i don't know if you noticed but in my true story adventures i'm now talking a lot more and that made me come out of my comfort zone too because i was very conscious of the people around me and now i just have to be in my own bubble and make it happen and i want to go and vlog in Disneyland Paris. Uh, my boyfriend and I went in 2018 and 2019 and then something happened to the world and hopefully soon we can go again. And if I have to dream big, I also want to vlog here in Florida and I am really looking forward to the moment that I can go to Disneyland or Disney World. And over here I wrote down get monetized. Now I know from the thousand uh, subscribers that I need, I only have 142 at the moment. But I really believe in it that this will happen soon, maybe in the next year. But I'm just manifesting it with this. So next year, I know within the year I will get monetized. And then I can make some little money out of the ads that you see. And that can help me to buy more thriftings and DIY stuff. But the last one is make YouTube my full-time job. This is my ultimate goal and I don't think it will happen anytime soon. But I'm putting it out in the world and I know this will happen. I don't know how many years it will take but it will happen because I really love to do this. And it really would be my dream job. Now here in the corner I also made something and these are a lot of different shapes and I need a lot of different things to make my videos. So I have also some leaves and it says that I want to grow all of this. And here I have the same. So I want to grow all of this if it makes sense. So this is my YouTube vision board and as I said I'm putting it out there and it doesn't matter if it takes a couple of years, I know eventually this will happen. So thank you so much for watching and I really hope you liked this and if you liked the video please push the like button and you can also subscribe to my channel if you want to see more and I will see you next time. Now officially tomorrow is the day that I am... Um, my youtube journey and YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. still a little bit dry oh, a little dry in 18 and 2019 we my boyfriend this in the corner also means something because i got some little show